Our research more generally is about studying human immune responses to TB and trying to understand which are the immune responses in the body which help to protect people against TB and that means protecting them either against getting infected in the first place or if once they're infected which are the sort of responses that can keep them in a state of long-term immune control and remain healthy whilst continuously suppressing the infection. So the goals of the Centre for Clinical Tropical Medicine include um, using scientific research to better understand uh, diseases that are common in developing countries um, and to use those results effectively to improve healthcare. And that's exactly what our research program is about, essentially. We're studying uh, one of the world's biggest killer diseases, tuberculosis. Um, we're using cutting-edge scientific tools to uh, study the disease and infection. And then we're translating the results of our studies to develop improved diagnostic tests, monitoring tests, and other types of tests to improve how we manage TB and how we look after patients with TB. Already in um, uh, our TB clinic uh, here at Imperial College Healthcare uh, NHS Trust where the result of the research we've done over the last decade has created a rapid new blood test for accurately diagnosing TB infection and whereas patients previously would come to us and have the old the hundred year old tuberculin skin prick test come back a week later to have it read and then often be told, well, the result is indeterminate because you've had the BCG vaccine in the past that may have made your test false positive. And oftentimes we didn't know really how best to handle patients with those sort of indeterminate results and false positive results, which were so common with the 100-year-old test. Nowadays, patients come to our clinic, they have the blood test performed, they have a result by the next morning, and we can definitively say to them whether they've been infected by TB bacteria or not and if they have been we can give them preventative therapy so it's really revolutionized uh, treatment in our own clinic and in all chest clinics around the UK.